So, my name's Oscar Hackin, and you can just call me Oz, and I'm the Head of Franchise Development at Remedy. Um, PC gaming is definitely part of our heritage at Remedy. Um, back from Death Rally, uh, Max Payne One and Max Payne Two, um, you know it's 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 a really important part of our studio and and uh, close to our development team's heart. So, um, you know, we're super excited to be bringing Alan Wake finally out on the PC, and it's coming to Steam on the 16th of February. Great. I had to figure a way out of this. Any second now and Stucky would be knocking on the door with his axe like Nicholson in The Shining. We've spent a lot of time getting this right. Um, not just doing a simple port, but doing the PC version justice. So there's a lot of graphical improvements um, for the PC version. Um, we've added some cool features like uh, some of, one of the features that was asked for on the Xbox 360 version was uh, remove HUD. Uh, people wanted uh, to get into this immersive gaming experience. Um, so we've put that feature there. Uh, we've put some support for stereoscopic 3D. Um, it's pretty niche. Uh, not many people have stereoscopic 3D setups at home, but those that do will definitely enjoy it. It's, it looks pretty damn cool. Um, and it supports multi-screen as well. Uh, yeah, so in general for the PC version, you're, you can expect high d higher fidelity uh, all round. We've, we really wanted to do the PC version justice. So yes, we have two separate versions uh, coming to both digital and to retail. We have the standard and the limited collector's edition and both versions will include uh, the DLCs, the signal and the writer. Now um, for the digital uh, versions, the standard uh, version, like I said, includes the DLCs. Uh, the limited collector's edition includes the DLCs plus the uh, developer documentary. Uh, it includes um, dev development uh, diaries. Um, as well as the uh, Alan Wake Files book that uh, was included in the Xbox 360 Limited Collector's Edition as well, as well as the, the soundtrack. Now for the retail version, we're doing something really uh, quite special for those people that have been waiting a long time for Alan Wake, of course. Um, on the retail side, the standard edition is, well, it's not really a standard edition, it's a better than standard edition. Uh, it's got the game, the DLCs, we've got stickers in there, we've got postcards, uh, we have a poster and we're including the soundtrack as well um, to the better than standard edition. And for the limited collects edition, there's all of the above, but the developer diaries, uh, the developer commentary and uh, the Alan Wake Files book included in that as well. So Alan Wake is coming out to PC on the 16th of February, uh, available on Steam, shortly followed with a retail release on March the 2nd. Yes, all right. 